Hello everybody and welcome to this week's update video. My name is Martin, I'm an Inkscape developer developing features and fixes for everyday Inkscape users. Except this week, um, due to popular demand, we've been asked to go through the About Screen contest and we're going to go through some, some of the top entries and we're going to have a talk about them in order to talk about them from a better perspective than just a programmer, I have invited a guest. Me! I've just been leaning back in this chair. <laughs> this is my d daughter, and we're going to be talking about these about screen contests. Um, I'm going to be taking some notes here. Oh, okay, so They're Violet. They're not real notes. Violet, what, uh, what do you know about Inkscape? I know that it's a thing where you can make art. Okay. Good, good. Uh, okay, so a lot of other pe pe people have made artwork, and we're going to be having a look at them to see what your opinions are, right? Okay! Okay. So the first artwork is called A Long, <gasps> a long Journey. That looks beautiful. I like the art style. Holding a paintbrush. Instead of like a, like a spear, they're holding a paintbrush like a spear. Violet, do you think that this artwork would be good for Inkscape? Um, yeah. Okay. I'm going to say that for a lot of them. That's true. They were all pre pretty good. Uh, this one is called Isometric Madness. <laughs> Instead of one that blasts out your ear, but, uh, your ears. <laughs> um, this is the winner, right? This is, this is the winner, yes. Yeah. I think a better winner could have been picked. Interesting. But I think the 20 years together does give it extra points. Yeah. Imaginary opinion points. Um, I kind of like it. Like all of the tools there, it's like it's it's like it's delivering the one point three update. Yeah, yeah, I, I, it's very one point three delivery coming up. <laughs> it's very a delivery practical. for one point three update for Inkscape. Okay, here you go. Um, this one's called Creative Growth. <sighs> so pretty, and it's purple, my favorite color. Okay, I I, I do like the the colors in, in this one. It's so bright and colorful. Yeah. I think a lot of kids would like this, especially y like younger ones. Like young, young kids, you think? Yeah. One of the things that people say is that uh, these, these graphics have to be for like professionals who are in jobs and things. No, they don't. Kids can draw with this. That's true. So you think that the graphics should be sort of like w wide? Wide range. Yeah. I think adults would also like this because it's beautiful. Yeah. And it's plants. Yeah. A herbologist would like this. A herbologist would like That's true. There's probably herbologists that use Inkscape. This one is called Portal. There's a portal! There is a portal. There's a little dragon crocodile thing. I know. There's, there's a lot going on in, the, in this one, isn't there? Yeah, there's a computer. I like this. I like this a lot. It's drawing Inkscape! Yeah, it's like a little Inkscape inside the Inkscape. Yes, and there's, a, there's that. There's that. I forget what it's called. There's Tux. that. The tux, the tux penguin. Yeah. It looks like it looks like the computer is surrounded by metronomes. <laughs> okay. That and one. there's a cup of coffee or tea. It depends. It could be both. Could be coffee and tea mixed together. Mm -hmm. Which I've never tried. It could be good. No, it's not good. It's not good. No. In your opinion. In my opinion. So this one is called <gasps> contest. So pretty. And this is the one I, I voted for because I thought the, the the rainbow effect would be pretty effective, especially on on a t-shirt. Oh, it's so pretty! It is pretty. It looks delicious for uh -huh. some reason. It looks delicious. Taste the rainbow. Okay. So the next one is called Inkscape Rocks. Ooh, two. Oh. So it is the Inkscape uh, Mountain, containing a whole bunch of electronic sound equip equipment. That. Let's rock! Let's rock! Yeah. I'm just, as I'm looking at it, I may take some notes at how good this is. Uh, it's on a grey scale, and I kind of like that. You kind of like that it's grey? Yeah. Interesting. They, they did a, a coloured ver version of this as well. A coloured version? Yeah. I want to see the coloured version. Oh, this is way better! I didn't know what that was! It's a disco ball! So let's continue. <laughs> the next one is called Coming Together. <laughs> oh, no, Creating to Together. Yeah, eating the screen. It's eating the screen! Why this, is the puppy is, eating the screen? This is one of my, my favourite ones. I may have... I may... I might have voted for this one. You, you think you would have voted for this one? Yeah. 
This, this is what, what impresses me. 20 years of Inkscape at, at the front. The Inkscape mountain in, in the window at the back with the little flowers and the stream and everything. Right, because it's a stream. Yeah. Hello, little Billy. You see, back in my time, we used pencil and paper to draw things, but now we use these fancy computers. Very good. <laughs> That's my grandma impression. <laughs> You see, Grandma, I just drag this over like this and drag this over like that and make a few circles and a few squares and, like, mold them a little bit. And there we go. We got a kitty. Okay, so the next one is called uh, The Puzzle of Creativity. <gasps> Looks so good. Yes. It's by uh, Srevin. There's a lot going on. I like the paintbrush. I like the fact that there's ones and zeros behind this. <gasps> that is cool. It's just... Here you go. It's more like, there. Oh, it's it's obvious. This one is called Happy 20 from Inkbot. Inkscabot. Inkscabot. It's Inkscabot. Inkscabot. What do you think? It's very cute. Yeah. There's little clouds and there's little... It's 3D, which is hard to draw. That is hard to draw in Inkscape. Really, think about it. Hard to draw at all, unless you're using like a 3D uh, modeling thing. Yes. Yeah, like Blender. Like Blender. Blender is good for 3D. Inkscape is good for 2D. Yeah, yeah, that's that's. Cool. Like you could use Inkscape to make textures and then Blender to make the 3D models that the textures go onto. Oh, wow, you you really do not know your stuff. Okay. And then like you could import that into a game you're making. Yes, yes, you can. Or just be making models for fun. This one is called Inkscape About Screen Contest Template 1.3 Black. Is that a fair? I think it is. It, I can't tell if that's Sonic. Yeah, it does look a lot like Sonic. Yeah, it's Sonic. <laughs> Were you like not saying that because like you didn't know if it actually did? No, I, I I thought it was like Sonic as well, but I like you to say it out loud without me suggesting it. Like it, it totally looks like Sonic. It totally does. Okay, so the next one is called uh, About Screen Contest. That says tw- twenty years. This one's pretty good. Well, I'm just wondering what the other outline is. Uh, is no, it's, it it's like blueprints. It's basically how you construct these these letters by using primitive shapes. So they're all. Oh, it's different. how you construct the letters and numbers. Yes. Oh my god! That's how you make the font consistent, so that the the letters look nice. So the next one we're going to look at is called Twenty Years of Inkscape for Creators." I get the impression you don't like this one. Yeah, not as much. What about this one called Idea Explosion? Ooh. Why was there pizza in my head? Where's my brain? Who nuked my head? Uh, do you think kids kids would like this one? It depends. A, ki- a lot of kids have a lot of different opinions. That is very true. Just very, very colorful as well. Okay, should we move on, on to the next one? I, like ki- I think kids like me would like this. Okay. Set the world on fire. Oh, that is beautiful, right? What do you see? It's beautiful. It's made out of flame. I like I like the sunrise and Saturn. There's a weird rock formation next to the 20. I mean, if you look at the space, the air in between, it looks like a drip. Last one, about screen excitement. Ugh, that looks like it's breaking. Breaking? The, the pencil. Oh, the, the tablet? The, the pen, why is it screeching? You're definitely doing it way too hard. Do you, do you like the image? Yes! It's amazing! Thanks for what watching, everybody. I hope you've seen some interesting artworks. Anyways, bye! Bye, everybody! Um, I am guess I'm just going to go now as I'm being pulled back into darkness. <laughs> hold on, hold on! Let me write this down!